Hello and welcome back to Debushri Day Art. It's been long I tried something new. So here it comes. My third art is dead. Doodling. Doodling is so common. I have seen so many doodlers doodling out there, yet I could never come out of acrylics and try them. So enough of thinking. Today I decided to try them out to see what good can I create. I am using A6 acrylic papers, these paints which have been holding for years and also these transparent watercolor folios that I have been holding for I think more than 5-6 years. So first up, I am going to try a simple doodle with these paints and color on top of it using these watercolor papers to see if these paints are waterproof. I bought them just because they are called to be waterproof but I have never tried them out to see if they are actually, so let's find it out. Okay, so doodling is done. Now it's time to add the colors and see if it works. I think the coloring is looking nice and the black paint color is not coming out. But wait, wait, whoops. Wow, I can see a little bit of black paint color mixing with the water and coming out. But it's not too much and it's not really making it look ugly. I think it's looking good and I am happy with it. Alright, now let's start some real doodling. As you know, I like painting landscapes, so I'm going to start with doodling some clouds. Okay, doodling is done and now I'm going to add some blue color to it. Alright, so the first one is done. Now I will create another landscape element, mountains. So let's doodle it out. Time to fill in some colors. I am adding the colors in my own creative way and trying not to stay within the lines and just spread the color all around. I love how these three are looking but I think I just want to make one more and I decided to create a monster leaf. 
I love my monstera plant. I have seen so many artists painting botanicals and yet I have never tried painting one ever. So today is my day to paint my most favorite monstera leaf. I never realized it's going to be so easy to doodle monstera. I guess it's just always big in our head until we try it. That's it. My doodling is done. I'm very, very happy with these four doodle paintings that I created. And more than that, it's so exciting to try something new. Do you enjoy doodling? If you haven't already doodled, do try this out. They are so easy to create and looks perfect as home decors. If you like this video, do give it a thumbs up and share with your artsy friends. And subscribe to my channel if you want to stay creatively inspired. Thanks so much for watching and I will see you in the next one.